Hello and welcome to episode number 10 of Cooking with Agent. Today we're making a butternut squash soup. And what better to brighten up a rainy, stormy day than this delicious, sweet soup? What you're going to need? You need a medium onion, some celery, two garlic cloves, some nutmeg to grate, some chives for garnish, one butternut squash, some ginger to grate, a microplane for the ginger and the uh, nutmeg, we need some salt and pepper to taste, some vegetable broth, a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of uh, soy milk for a garnish, a either immersion blender or a standard blender. I got this to stay hydrated. Good stuff. Let's get started. Okay, first thing we're going to do, take our butternut squash, cut through right here. Be careful. It can be difficult to cut through if the knife's not very sharp. Be very careful. Cut the top off. We're just going to stand it up. Trim the sides off. There you go. You're going to take your bottom part, cut the very bottom off, cut her in half. I'm going to scoop out all the seeds and stuff in the center. Okay, now we're just going to trim off the stuff on the outside of the bottom. The knife is a lot easier than the vegetable peeler if you're not comfortable with using a knife. Go ahead and use the vegetable peeler, it just takes a little longer. Piece of cake. Okay, now that we're all peeled, we just want to cut it into little cubes. About like that, like one inch squared. And up on the pile of squash, up like this. You just want to set this aside. You're going to want to dice up your celery and onion. Celery is next. And you want to crush your garlic. Let me just peel it real quick. Peel is always the easiest after you've crushed it. Tap the ends off. Okay, we're ready to start cooking. Okay, we got our pan hot. Put in a little bit of olive oil, about two tablespoons. Add your onions and celery. You want to make sure you get that nice sizzling sound when you put it in there. You're going to cook them like this for about five minutes. All right, we're just going to cook them like this for five minutes. And make sure you put a lid on. Okay, here we are five minutes later. A little stir stir. Now you want to go ahead and add in your butternut squash. A little bit of fresh ground nutmeg. That's about good. Fresh ground ginger root. And your two garlic cloves. Put them in the press. Nice and easy. 
squeeze them through. Cut the other bit out. Give it a little stir. I'm going to cook this like this for about 10 minutes. Covered. Okay, here we are about five minutes later. We want to check it. Oh wow, the aroma coming off here is amazing. Combination of these smells, oh wow. going to be delicious. Do you want to give it a little stir? Come back, check it in another five minutes. You do want to stir it occasionally so it doesn't burn. Okay, here we are five minutes later again. Oh, that's amazing. Wow. I can't wait. I haven't had this in several months. It's so good. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and add our vegetable broth in. I got completely organic vegetable broth under my thumb there. And actually, this whole soup is organic. It's good for the vegetarians that don't like meat or any animal products. You just want to put just enough to cover it. Put all the squash underneath. We're going to simmer it like this for about 20 minutes. Okay, here we are 20 minutes later. Cooked down nicely. Our squash is nice and tender, which is what we're looking for. Careful, it's hot. Now we're going to want to go ahead and blend it up. Turn the burner down. you got two ways of doing this, either in the conventional blender, an immersion blender. I'm going to use the immersion one. Okay, you're looking for a consistency like this. That's perfect. Want to be careful. Watch out for the bubbles, they're like lava. Season it up to your liking. Gonna put just a little bit of salt in. Fresh ground black pepper. Hold the stir. All right, and we're ready to give it a shot. All right, here we are. Got a little garnish going on. Put just a little bit of soy milk on top, a little grated nutmeg, and some chives. Let's go ahead and do the ultimate test. See how it tastes. Perfect. Oh, wow. So delicious. So good. Everything's so fresh. Yep. You guys are going to love this one. Thank you for watching episode number 10 of Cooking with Agent. We made butternut squash soup. Please remember to rate, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. You can follow me on Twitter at real R E A L A G N T 96. Thank you. Bye. Okay, this is what you're looking for.